Yo, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Demonte, bringing you a banger. Don't forget to go follow on my Twitch, please. Here, you will never miss out on daily payday content. Isn't it? Yeah, it's the grenade bag. It looks like a, uh, a COVID mask. <laughs> it looks like you have a COVID mask. My guy's got one COVID mask in his pocket. Why is it so ugly? You've got one COVID mask in your pocket. That's it. Follow. LOL. <laughs> That's what it looks like though, don't it? Looks like a mask. Don't do anything stupid. Don't 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 act dumb. I need to take HP damage to see what kind of HP region I'm working with. Yeah, go ahead and shoot me, actually. Yeah. Do some damage to me. I take all your fucking bullets! I take all your fucking bullets! Alright, let's see what my HP region's like. Not bad, not bad so far. So this is going to be more of a consistent, you don't want to get shot build. I see this now. You do not want to lose HP in this setup. Need hostage taker, yeah. You, as I just now seen, it's a pretty slow HP regen. You're going to want to be not losing a lot of hp consistently you want to be kind of not you don't want to be under 225 obviously but you just don't even want to get under like three fourths hp i want to say because it's going to be a, a struggle to get back that's what it feels like so far but that was only a split second of using it it was only you know like 20 damage done or something can you set it to friends only what do you mean rocky Oh, okay. Wait, what's wrong with you? Oh, you need hostage taker. Yeah, unfortunately, it's not as strong as the grinder's HP region, but it's definitely strong. Like, it's not weak or anything. And you get HP region from headshots, too. You gotta remember that, Rocky. It's not like you're out of HP region. Like if you didn't have hostage taker or grinder damage, you could be shooting headshots too. Oh, that, that fucking swap speed's really good actually. Unlike all the builds, that swap speed's super good. Want to try it? Yeah, you can join, bub. Rejoin, Rocky. Do, do a... Uh, you should be able to join. You could try whatever you want, I was just saying. In my build, I've got hostage taker, but in, in, in thought process, you might be able to make it work without it. Because of grinder HP and headshots. Because you'd get two HP for a few seconds, and then you'd also get 10 HP for a headshot. So then that's also continuously stacking HP quickly. But it's not as quick as 400, 500 HP quick. That's why first aid kits, hostage taker is going to be a big deal on this setup. I just want to see maxed out HP regen here with like hostage taker. Yeah, yeah, this builds. That's what the one I'm using too. I hope you got it. It's pretty good. It uh, it definitely holds up so far. But I've not gotten into a crazy scenario yet where I've had to take big HP you know dip. Follow me quickly. And I'm not trying to play like you know not aggressive either. Like I'm trying to be in the fight here. I mean, low damage doesn't do shit to you. If you get hit by some low damage, you get shrug it off. Better than the muscle. So this essentially changes some of the things in the game. Muscle doesn't all honestly have good region comparing it to, to what you call it, copycat now. Muscle's region is kind of like, it's decent and all, but <clears throat> it, it could obviously be <clears throat> um, overmatched with the muscle or with the copycat. Well, why don't you guys tell me if it's a key card? I didn't grab it. Let's 
I thought Rocky ran inside there. Yeah, the HP regen is definitely great. It's not bad, it's, but I'm not taking once again a huge massive HP dip either. I noticed that it doesn't trigger your HP regen, I don't believe, until you have HP loss. I've not really seen HP regen as soon as I lost HP. But that might be coincidental. Because of a short duration of HP regen. Oh, does this have two jokers? I don't remember. This build definitely helps it helps itself though. I like it. Definitely meta. Definitely makes some builds not needed, but also will have to require some builds to be better than what the copycat's producing. Like if once again the kingpin or the sociopath or something. Those would be like two instances of something in the leech, like things like that, that the copycat don't necessarily get better than. Like the, the Sicario, it don't, it don't get better than the Sicario because it only has a smoke bomb, but no dodge percentage. So like your Sicario might still outperform in that you know scenario. But if you have the smoke bomb with the leech or not with the leech, with the copycat playing with a Sicario, you might be able to help him out. Or help your teammates that are dodge or you know something along that area but it's not bad i like uh i like the play style so far the the grinder hp setup not bad i was hoping the armor percentage would help you not have to grab the 20 armor points and the enforcer for ballistic vest but like you have to grab all the armor percents to like even i think get close probably and like that's just not ideal because if you're wanting to build to have some HP and get you know an easier armor percent like you just go for diehard still like that's the play still so light damage so far is all I've taken I've not gotten hit by a heavy unit so far is when I do get hit by a heavy unit I will see how that life regen acts nice so let's see it not bad, actually. Not bad, actually. Not bad at all. And headshots make it fucking... You just get health regen like crazy. This build's not hard, actually. I think life or first aid kits may not be needed in this scenario. That could easily save points there. But if you get completely dumped on HP, you're going to want a first aid kit. So, a little difference there. I think it's crazy that I have muscles HP, though. That's, that's what's insane. Because the grinder gives you an HP percentage of like 20% and then the build gives you a bunch of 20% Like you can give yourself 20% from the perk So yeah, this is strong. This actually gives grinder like a new life. Uh, not like a new life, but It gives copycats grinders version a new life Because grinder I'm not saying that it's tossed in the shadows or never gets played or anything, but it definitely isn't in like the top playing field or of anything. It's not to anyone's top picks essentially. Um Well something like this could make, you know, the grinder's ability at least be a top pick. If I make a copycat video, it's going to be like the ultimate copycat build video or something. And then it's going to have like a, all these builds in that video. Does that sound like a plan, everybody? How, how does chat feel about that one? The HP regen on the headshot's nasty, dog. Like, this is better than the grinder. <laughs> like, this is straight up better than the grinder, dude. Oh, this is straight up is. 
<laughs> like grinder i probably would have done been down by now like no not in this build you fucking just struck off, struck off anything it's like oh damage that's nothing can you use armor you can use light ballistic vest so the highest armor yield that you can get is 91 with also getting like 70 as your baseline you can either use the suit for dodge or you can use the light ballistic vest with armor that's the only two options you have inside the grinder ability if it's not the grinder ability then you don't get that life regen and you just you know gotta change to something else So what build do you have, Rocky? I thought you was playing the same one, aren't you? You got grinder, right? But you got suit on. HP dot. I'll see if sneaky. Sneaky and like sprinting. <laughs> Yeah, I have a build just like that, just not on the setup. I made that just a little bit ago too, the HP grinder dodge. I think the actual grinder, like, it's only a couple shots. Like, if you were to go like this, like, shoot once, wait till the health regen stops, shoot again, wait till the health regen stops, and then shoot again. Like, it's only a couple shots, and it really gives you all your HP back. Um... But obviously, that's not how you're going to regen yourself every time. You're going to be just blasting at the cop shin early. Ooh, that nasty fucking armor gate. Oh, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Oh, the fucking invincibility saved my ass. The invincibility saved my ass, bro. I totally forgot I had that in Leech or in Copycat. Dude, once you get half or under 50% HP, you're immune to health damage. And that's what just happened there. I got survived for that. That's insane. <laughs> That's literally insane. You can't die in this build. I forgot how insane this build is. You have two seconds of invulnerability that literally is just unkillable build. Run! Very interesting. <clears throat> yeah, this is actually a really fucking strong build. So now that makes me remember that inside of the full hp and the rogue elusive build that means that one also once i get under 50 percent, i'm just un unkillable for a second or for two seconds actually that's just insane what a concept for a build massive hp regen They really did some crazy uh, concepts in this build, because its natural skills are insane on the on the copycat too. Like auto refilling your weapons, getting fucking a super fast regen, or weapon swap, getting a goddamn HP regen on headshots, getting dodged bullets to reflect back onto the enemy, getting fucking. HP 50% then you take no damage like dude, that's insane That's a lot of things working for you And then also you have the HP buffs the HP buffs and all this other stuff going on the armor the HP the dodge the movement speed The movement speed I feel is not that useful though unless you're stealthy obviously Outside of that it probably isn't that useful It could be, but 
from my standpoint and from what I've seen currently, it's not going to be that useful unless it's a stealth game mode. <clears throat> and you can be mad aggressive with this HP amount. And it's different HP than the actual muscle, so it's slight different playstyle than the actual muscle. You got copycat? Yeah, this is copycat with muscle HP. So 460 HP with grinder regen. So if I get under 50% HP, I get immune to health damage for two seconds. So I'm essentially unkillable is what this build says, basically. If you get under 50% HP, you just don't die. <laughs> That's what that means. And since I have grinder HP regen during that two seconds of waiting, I can regen HP and be, you know, good to go again. It's uh, it's pretty crazy. And I built over 20 builds, so that's interesting. Every build that I set up was strong builds. Everything that I tried to make was something that is going to be a powerful setup. Leave me alone, shield, you pussy punk bitch. Ouch. So I used my two seconds on homeboy, the shield. And as you see, I'm kind of slowly regening HP, but it's not like bad at all. Like I'm still getting enough HP regen. No. Rocky needs a first aid kit. Here you go, Bubba. Or just run. That's fine. I tried to heal you, bro. Okay, I'm not gonna risk it either. This build is nearly unkillable, but not that unkillable. Like, you'll die in that scenario. Okay. <laughs> you'll die in that scenario. Or at least he gets you, maybe. Never mind. So, Rocky Star Spider Wire. Or Spider Wire. Rocky Star thing.